Hey there, and welcome back to another episode of Fishing the 45th. Today, I'm excited. We're going to get on some ice, hopefully find some walleyes and some perch. New lake, I've never fished it before, and I've heard a ton. It's in our area, so there's really no excuse. But, uh, yeah, we're going to get on some walleyes tonight. I can just feel it. Now, Chris, tell me, what was the secret to your success? <laughs> I have no idea. They came right off the bottom. Though. There's ice on the bank. Woo! The lake trout made it. That is another very good representation of what not to do. Are you kidding me, people? Look how beautiful it is! Holy smokes! What a beautiful day to be going fishing. Exciting. It's windy, boys. Very windy. baby so if I'm gonna be out here for any amount of time I'm gonna have to set out a windbreak because I am uh, freezing it's not real chilly it's probably like 25 degrees but it's low in like 20 so I'm gonna see if I can't cherry rig something together to keep me out the wind cursor right now. This is the thinking as to the location of our spot. If you look at this particular drop-off that runs right through here, you can see that these contour lines are very close together right through this section. Now when you have a long sharp break like this one here, it's nice to even pick it apart further and be more specific to get on top of more fish. So let's start out here in this, I'm going to call it a uh, flat, even though it's not one depth, they're so spread out that if you were out on this, it would feel like a flat. You know, we've got 29 feet to 33 feet and this is probably two, three, four hundred yards right here. So for all intents and purposes, this is a big flat, okay? Then you start coming up on the shelf, but it's a gradual, it's a gradual uh, shelf that's coming up. And then you get to right about here throughout this whole section, and then there's a, a dynamic change in the speed in which it's getting shallow. What we did is we looked at this and we said, where do we have the hardest break? And the hardest break we could find is right here. We were sitting in about that 20 foot of water. We had one tip up, not very far, maybe 20 feet in front of us. 
in about 13 foot of water and then one right behind us in about 22 and we were sitting in about 20 right on that hard break the thinking is that these fish are going to be coming through on these contours and they're going to be sprinkled through but right here a lot of those fish are going to come up hit this hard break and swim past right here most of the time they're not going to swim up that hard break they might drift up into here they might drift up over here but on this really really steep break they're going to come through and come right through our gear so that is the thinking as to why we were sit up right where we were on this trip back to the show okay there we go oh he's running this is a pike oh yeah this is not big whatever it is i think it's a perch dude perch it's a little waller illegal look at the color First one on this lake, that's a beautiful walleye. Well, look at the colors on that. Beautiful fish. Cool. Hey Chris, you know what this fish is? It's not. Seven to eight. <sighs> Seven to eight, baby! He's catching up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Yeah. Chris just set up a uh, GoPro on his tip up. And if it goes off, it's gonna be a real cinematic shot for you. Play. Nothing like being the camera guy gets to run his behind back and forth. Ooh, you got yourself a little snowed in there, eh? Oh, he's there, huh? What do you think it is? A 12 inch perch? Oh yeah! Chris likes to throw his fish on the snow before he uh, shows them to the camera. Nice and dirty up. So they all look like that. They're a little bit more, yeah, they're dark and kind of like a speckled look. Almost looks like a, they have kind of a black crop. What is that? Nine, nine, seven? Nine, seven? Okay. Not even, not even, not even. Hey, baby. You son of a gun. This is the hot tip up right here. Alright, does he throw this one on the ice? I don't think so. That's a pike! <laughs> Look at that! It's not, it didn't hit the ice! <laughs> uh, yeah, it's over on my sled. My sleigh. Bring him on. Bring him on over. Is he gulleted, or are you gonna be able to get that out? Look at that! The hook just pops right out. That's what they say, right? It's a fat one for a long Yeah. Deal. Release that fat beast. Oh, look at that! Is that the first time you've ever done that before? Maybe legal. Yeah. I just feel like walking all the way over your sweat. <laughs> Look at that. Alright, good catch, man. Alright, we got a flag. We have a flag.
What do you think it is, Pike? Is it really? Oh boy. Crazy. Nine to eight. How do you feel about yourself right now, Beth? Feels good. Can I borrow your cable stack? Yeah. Another you know, beautiful 17 incher. The only problem with fishing with tip ups is that they're almost always. He's going in the pot. I'd like to take a break from our normally scheduled program to just show you how flippin' beautiful it is. Ugh. Oh. Man, oh man. I tell you what. There's no better place to be than outside. lithium here for our light. Alright. Chris has got a flag. While I'm running over there, you guys, if you use a lot of electronics and uh, or you spend a lot of time outdoors, pick one of these things up. It weighs like two pounds and it's just the best thing I've ever had. Now a walleye. <laughs> Hopefully he's there. Beautiful. Just the last little bit of light here. Like That's fish. for sure a keeper. Look at how fat and healthy those are. Oh, yeah. You know, the, all these fish are those perfect eater size fish. Yep. It's almost perfect because we just started fishing walleyes. We're trying to, you know, get a couple of walleye dinners in. I'm actually having one tonight. Yeah, I am. Yeah, you know, actually, now that we're here, you need to get that uh, fish safely unhooked, and then we'll, I think we should end this video. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Look at that, pop it right out. <laughs> Thanks for watching Fish in the 45th. This episode was a fun one. We came out here and explored this new body of water. Yeah, I like that. I've never ice fished before at all. And me either. Yeah. I've, only opened, I've only fished in open water. And uh, yeah, caught some fish. We'll be back to dial it in. But uh, I think we're out of something out here. I think it's pretty good. Stay tuned. We'll have some more out here. Yeah, Make like sure. and subscribe. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> jumped out on there. But like and subscribe. Show us your support, man. Yeah, seriously. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. All right.